Okay, this was a mistake. What, coming to this mansion? Yeah, I'd have to agree with shit, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if it was our smartest idea coming here. Now, if I could grab a health pack before everyone else steals them like little thieves, that'd be great. What is that? That is a baseball bat. Do we want a good old fashioned baseball bat? It's probably not gonna help us against the ghost, so what's the point? But we do have the auto shot here. There's some creepy posters. Whoever lived here had a creepy choice of interior design, and I'm not gonna lie. Like, seriously, these. Look at that! Zombies and ghosts? Oh man, this is gonna be cool. Yeah, there's a creepy laugh. Oh, and really? this. Seriously, where's Eddie Murphy when you need him? When do we walk into the haunted mansion? I don't understand. So spooky! Yes, not really. I hope the person that owns this house is Dracula. I hope he talks like that. That'd be great. So spooky! Oh! Was that seriously a jump scare? Okay, note to the creator, and I don't mean this, this is constructive. You may or may not want to have the, like, the scream. Okay, yeah, a bit like that. That was good. I like that. That was effective. It was effective. Maybe a, a noise to accompany it, accompany it as well. I'm still waiting for the creepy, creepy whispering. The creepy voices, okay? I've heard people laughing, and I stopped being scared of that when I was, like, two years old. They do have some creepy posters, though, don't they? Oh, the door closed itself. So spoopy. The Mona Lisa, what happened to you, girl? You let yourself go. Damn. What's that supposed to mean, coach? Oh, that was a creepy noise. Oh, the eyeballs. They're always watching. Wow. Shall we go say hello? Are you being serious? Let's go say hello, shall we? Hey, creepy room. How's it hanging? Oh, you are literally a 2D. Hold on to this first aid kit. I'm not answering that phone. Okay. Hello? Hello? Sorry, he's not here now. You have to call back later. See, if that was like a one missed call thing, that screaming was Ellis. So spoopy. Seriously, eyeballs. Chill out, dude. Okay. You're not spoopy anymore. In fact, you are beginning to be soupy more than spoopy. <laughs> Aha, referencing my own stupid mistakes of saying soupy instead of spoopy. <laughs> I'm a genius sometimes. Okay, so where are we heading to now? Come on, is there any more spoopiness? Is this room going to be spoopy? Are they going to be like... Oh, I don't know how many places do this. I think they do it in Disneyland, but you know when bodies appear on the ceiling? I think that's the thing they do in their haunted houses at Disneyland, right? To be able to pass this way, haunted music you must play, for the piano in this hall will forever break this wall. Let me guess, there's a tank behind that wall. We'll see you, shall we? We played it. Here they come. Last time I played a piano a tank game, and I wasn't wrong. I was right. I'm always right, okay? I know what I'm talking about. I'm not crazy. Are you seriously dead? Oh, the music just stopped. Okay, there it is. It's back. Okay, tank. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got, man. What you got? You ain't got much. You're dead. Why are there just creepy kids in the poster? I'm not gonna lie. That is slightly off -put. Well, let's be right. Let's be honest, no one likes little kids, right? That's not true. People love little kids. I don't get the appeal myself, but you know. Oh, are these... Uh, so I take it these are the creepy voices. When I thought creepy voices, I was kind of expecting like... I don't know, like whispers. You know, whispers are always scary, you know. They're like the most common horror movie trait ever. Oh, you're so spoopy. I don't even know what that's meant to be. That's just like an old timey painting, you know. That's a masterpiece. Not very spoopy. Oh, spoopy! Is there anything gonna be... Ah, oh, scary. I like the painters, I'm not gonna lie, they're interesting to look at. Oh, that's spoopy! And I wasn't referring to the jump scare that appeared for half a second at the end of the thing, I was talking about the jockey that decided it'd be appropriate to hump on my face, like that. That isn't... That isn't a tank. You wanna know how I know that isn't a tank? Because I don't even use that tank music anymore, so I have tricked you, map. Fortune teller room! It's in the heart of the cards, witch! Hey, witch, I thought you didn't like light. 
See how you like this! I missed! Terribly! Holy crap, I'm awful! I am now dead, I paid the price! <laughs> Did you see that jump scare that appeared at the end of the corridor? That was pretty spooky, right? You were scared! I knew you were! <laughs> Don't lie to me! Did I use my health pack? Yeah, I must be finding me a health kit. Yeah, I, me a health kit. I don't know why I gave you that voice, but Ellis, I feel like you should start. I saw that couch move! I'm not crazy! I'm not crazy! Okay? Here. I know the tricks of the trade. Right tuxedo zombie. Right of the zombie. Right of the floating book zombies. Oh, I'll keep heading to that spooky voice. I ain't even afraid. Oh, that's so spooky. I watch you from the outside. I'm terrifying. I'm almost certain this is a hard and seek map. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. That's creepy. See? You bring that. Bring that to the game. I will poop myself gladly. I will gladly poop myself if you are willing to bring that to the table, okay? The Midnight Riders, they were here. Reloading. Reloading. I will get you to zombie thing. <laughs> uh, I know I shouldn't be poking foot oh, at this map. The piss out of me. Oh, they knocked the piss out of me. The thing is, the way that's my like protective countermeasure to not being scared is just taking the mick out of the scares. And I know, I know that that's one interesting countermeasure, but that's how we I roll. You know? Yeah, but what would make it into, like, if you wanted jump scares to scare people, you need to really have, like, a really ridiculously loud screen that goes along with it. That makes people poop themselves. Just <laughs> I like play the brown note along with it, and people will, people will poop. Okay, look, pe that isn't gonna make people poop. Okay, hooded figures that think they're scary. Think that is not also going to make people poop. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I wouldn't poop to that. <laughs> On a scale of one to poop, how much poop would you rate this? Look at all these creepy posters, though. I'll prop them on that. They managed to do some really good research into getting creepy ass like paintings and stuff. Creepy, creepy paintings, empty rooms, Reloading. boomer rooms by the sounds of things, maybe. There is a boomer nearby, I can hear him. I can hear him. If he wants to show himself, he can gladly do so. I will oblige you. Oh, you're not a boomer. <laughs> oh, the lights will flicker on and off. The walls will lose green slime. Oh, I can't remember that Spongebob episode well enough to know what I think. It's the phone, yeah, is it the lights will flicker on and off first, the phone will ring three times and there'll be nobody there. And then the rules will grew, like ooze green slime, oh wait, they always do that. I don't know. It's bit, I need to watch that episode, that was a good episode of Spongebob. I don't know how much Spongebob in ages, but I got, that was probably my favorite episode. Talking of scary cartoons. I'm not saying that Spongebob is scary, but that episode was kind of creepy. It wasn't really. But Courage the Cowardly Dog. Now that's a show. I was a big fan of that as a little kid. Big fan. More red lights, as we all know. Very spooky. Spooky, spooky skeletons. Okay. That door's not open. Let me guess. Are we heading through that door, then? The spooky red room. Oh, so spooky! It had blood on the door. That will give you nightmares forever. Ooh. Where are we heading? I feel like I'm lost. Hey, dude, if you do, you, do you do you know the way around this mansion? Cause I don't. I always feel like someone is watching me. I don't know why that came to my head, but I feel like in this kind of building, someone would always be watching you, like in the in the paintings. You know, it's the old trope in like Scooby Doo and stuff, like where someone's always watching in the paintings. Ooh, the bod. Let's get out of here. That noise was quite creepy. I don't want to find out what it was. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. We went through the haunted house and made it out alive. I guess I did something to celebrate, but the tunnel, we probably won't survive that. I'm not going to lie. That could be pretty spoopy. It gives us a heart attack and then we poop ourselves and die.